We got jewelry designed by an engineer to encourage girls to go into STEM, science, technology, engineering, and math. All right, so the engineer's company is SciChic, and the founder, Aaron Winnick, is joining us from Gainesville, Florida. So, Aaron, how did you get into making jewelry, more specifically uh, science related jewelry? Yeah, well, as a kid, I just always loved making stuff. So ranging from sewing to building Lego towers, it was my passion. And that's what inspired me to do engineering in the first place. So I decided I wanted to combine both my passions and try to find a way to encourage young girls who might have both of those interests to go into science or engineering as well. So you use a 3D printer. How do you do that? How do you make the jewelry? Yeah, so we 3D print in both plastics and metals. So we do all the plastic stuff in-house on our own 3D printers, and then we outsource the metals, and it's all made, all the designs on our own computers with engineering software as well. What age range are these for? So for the kids, we try to target between 7 and 14 because middle school is the age that a lot of girls might drop off in their interest in science and engineering. We want to show them that engineering and science can be fun, creative, and even fashionable around that age. Oh, it's very neat. Now, you have these subscription boxes, which are pretty common these days. What goes inside this box? Yeah, so we want to do provide some other educational materials along with our different jewelry. So every month we have a different science theme that goes out, and we pair our jewelry with interviews with women in STEM, educational materials, videos showing the actual 3D printing of the pieces that went in the boxes, mm -hmm. and try to make a fun science experience every month. It might be a little different than they might get in other areas. We, of course, are obsessed with the weather ones, which we have in front of us, but what are some of the other science themes that you are um, you know, sending out in your boxes? Yeah, we have everything from coding to space uh, to chemistry. Next month we're doing Build It, so we're doing the tools of science, kind of bridging all different areas. And we have lots of other ones coming up, and we like doing lots of partnerships with women in STEM to get their ideas about what science jewelry should be and different areas that can inspire the jewelry. So we have lots of new stuff coming up and collaborations with everyone from meteorologists to astrophysicists. So you feature a woman in STEM every month too, right, inside your box? Exactly, yeah, and we want to try to get people from lots of different areas, ranging from coders at Microsoft to PhD students, to show that there's lots of different faces to, to scientists and people in technology out there. All right, so if you want more on this, where should we send people? Uh, go to SciChic.com, S-C-I-C-H-I-C.com, and we have on all the social medias as well, at SciChic as well. All right, Aaron, thank you so yeah, much. Yeah, very and impressive, Aaron. Great job. Bravo. Love it.